Alright, to build a marshmallow cannon, which is this, you're gonna need marshmallows. Well, not to build it, but just to, yeah. You need stiff paper, a uh, grill igniter, which I'm not sure if you can see it, but it gives off a little spark, which is enough to ignite the hairspray. Then you need an elbow piece for the cannon, and this all comes together as one piece. I'm not sure what it's called, it's a strange number. But you do that, you put the elbow on, take the barrel, put it into the hole, you put that in, and there you go. That's your marshmallow can. Very simple, very easy. All right, to load the marshmallow, in case you can't see it when we do it outside, is you get a marshmallow and you get a pretty good sized piece of paper to wrap it in. And you pretty much, after that, shove it in there and you get something that looks like this. So, let me put this in. You know, make sure it's nice and tight, nice snug fit. And to load it, you get, you get the bottom of it. You put however much hairspray, hold down for a second, two seconds, one squirt, or whatever. You plug in the spark plug, and you shoot it. Alright, what I'm going to do this time is the two squirt test, which is a one of those. I'm not sure how to scientifically say that. Put the spark plug in, and fire. All right, we're gonna do the one second, which is a 1001. Put spark plug in. Three, two, one. So that proves that too much hairspray will not work.